The LAPD needs your help this morning. They're trying to identify a young boy who was abandoned at Union Station last night. CBS 2's Greg Mills, he's live in downtown LA with details, and this has been a really difficult situation. It's been going on for a few hours, Greg. More than 12 hours now, Sandra and Jeff. Yeah, we're going to hear from a woman who witnessed the entire thing. She is the supervisor here at uh, Cafe Crate. And this is where the boy was abandoned at those tables last night. LAPD has no idea who this boy is. We'll show you his picture. LAPD believes the boy is six, seven, or eight. This is what he was wearing when abandoned, but he doesn't speak. He isn't deaf. LAPD believes he could be a boy with autism. The boy is now with the Department of Children and Family Services. The supervisor at Cafe Crepe says the boy and a woman sat at one of their tables for about half an hour. It was about 6.30 last night. The woman took off, and then a server spotted her about 40 minutes later wandering around Union Station, and she picks up the story here. He was sitting uh, eating wato pretzel for about 30 minutes or so, and then we noticed that the uh, woman that he was with kind of just wandered off. And when we did find her uh, back in this area again, we tried to notify her, like, hey, this uh, child I'm hoping is yours uh, is here, but she literally walked right out the door. She walked out the door and didn't say a word, didn't even really acknowledge them. There is one security camera inside Cafe uh, Crepe, and uh, they have not turned that over to LAPD just yet. She will turn it over when that does happen. That security camera points at the counter right there. There are no security cameras, she said, outside uh, this business. So it's going to be kind of tough, especially with the communication problems this little boy has. Reporting live from Union Station, Greg Mills, CBS 2 News.